Okay, awesome, a ton hole 9 with around 500,000 gold and 300,000 elixir. So lots of resource, and we're gonna attack it. King's right there at the south, so we're gonna avoid him. Queen's at this side as well, so we're just gonna attack from the right side. Uh, we're gonna try to have our queen go towards the south here. All right, the cannon is right at the outside, so very easy to remove as well. Uh, here we have three point defenses, the cannon, the archer tower. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna send out three hog riders uh, that archer tower is being distracted by uh, my own archer tower, so it's going to remove it. So pay close attention to that archer tower. She's going to remove the... Okay, perfect. And then they're going to remove the cannon just on time. Do I need to use her ability or rage? Uh, No, no, nope. Perfect. <laughs> so my finger was right on that, uh, that her icon. But good thing we don't need to use our ability. So now we're going to send in our Barbarians and Archers and open up here. There's a Wizard Tower though. Okay, there we go. Break inside here, come on. There we go, Barbarians, Archers. Again, the Queen's at the red zone. She's being targeted by a Tesla and uh, an Expo. But we're going to have our Barbarians and Archers come here and just make things easier for her here. And uh, send out those clan castle troops. I should request for hog riders for my clan castle because uh, they're gonna be very good. So here we're gonna use a raid spell right here. Uh, break inside with the wall breakers. There we go. We've broken inside here. And those barbarians and archers. It's gonna remove a bunch of threats here. Uh, do we need to use that poison? Nah, don't need to use it. But yeah, queen's making her way inside. She's gonna remove the mortar and then she's gonna go for. The expo, actually no, she went the other way, so she's going for the gold storage. Okay. Now the good thing is we still haven't used her ability, so that's great. And we still have a lot of re uh, spells, but I usually don't like using more than one spell. So I've already used one rage, so I'm hoping not to use another one. But since I have my spell factory boosted, I guess I might use another rage spell if needed. Uh, she's gonna go for the wall here even though she could have just walked around here uh, but I guess her AI doesn't you know go that far um, she's gonna remove the archer tower one minute left so plenty of time to get another two storages and uh, I might need to use her ability uh, if she's being targeted by both that queen and okay, yeah, she's being targeted by the queen Tesla and the opposing archer queen. So we're gonna have to pop her ability here remove that storage and the Tesla perfect and Let's see the other point defenses are the archer tower here and the cannon at the south So looks like we can just get that dark elixir storage and we might have to head out after that Otherwise, she's going to get targeted by multiple point defenses. If she gets targeted by a uh, Archer Tower, we're going to have to end it. Yeah, she's getting targeted by the Archer Tower, so we're going to have to end it there. But we got lots of resource. 367 gold, 250,000 elixir, 2400 uh, dark elixir. Awesome. Okay, great. 360,000 each. Uh, main threat are the heroes at the core. You got a queen and a king there. But look, one of the expos are inactive. Uh, Wizard Tower is very weak, Mortar is level 5, so very easy base to attack. Just the heroes at the core are going to be the main issue. Uh, so what we're going to do is let's see, we're going to send out Queen here, healers behind, and uh, really, really not worried about any of the point defenses either. Uh, they're very weak, level 8, level 7 point defenses. So let's see. Um... She's gonna go for the wizard tower, then the archer tower, then the gold mine, and then the barrack, and she's gonna make her way towards the top. Okay. Nope, she's gonna make her way towards the south, actually. She's gonna go for the laser storage. Alright. I mean, either direction is fine. That's what I really like about this method, is that you don't really need to have her go in a certain direction. You it just... You just need her to go in one direction and once you know the direction she's gonna go uh, then you can plan and just break inside make that entry point and uh, core the base so here we're gonna do that test for bombs first awesome found the giant bomb there 
Gonna use that uh, two wall breakers, open up that layer, send down more of, more of our barbarians and archers, have them all spread inside. And uh, do we need to use hog riders? No, but yeah, we don't need to use hog riders. There's a Tesla right there. Uh, we're gonna just send out two pairs of wall breakers. We don't need to use a rage because we can break inside pre pretty easily. Let's help out our queen here with that one wall breaker. Um, that one wall breaker, where is he going? Okay, there he is. And uh, we're gonna use another wall breaker to then open up that layer and have our queen get inside that core. Awesome. And let's see here. Both, I've taken both of his heroes out, so that's great. So it's just gonna be a walk in the park. A queen walk in the park here. <laughs> no pun intended. Um, hmm. We have one minute and 25 seconds. So plenty of time to get a lot of resource. Uh, here she's getting targeted by that expo. But really weak expo, Tesla. Not to worry. And uh, I also don't need to use my hog riders either, so I guess I'll just save them. No point in wasting them and no point in uh, wasting Dark Elixir because hog riders do cost Dark Elixir. And I don't really use them all uh, in every raid. Like this raid, I'm not using them. So I'm just saving Dark Elixir. I'm saving camp space as well, more importantly. I'm saving 30 camp space worth of uh, troops. So when I come back to my base, I'm gonna see that I have a lot of uh, troops ready. So here she's gonna remove that Tesla and then she's gonna go for the elixir storage and then the air defense mortar gold storage and hopefully she makes her way towards the other two storages over there. 36 seconds, come on, come on. 30 seconds, we're gonna activate her, abil her ability here. No, a giant bomb there. Okay, she's made her way there. She's, she's getting targeted by three point defenses. Um. That air sweeper is blowing our queen back, so she's recovering a bit slowly here. We're just gonna use that raid spell here, 10 seconds left, and the reason I'm using it is just to recover her, replenish her health, so that I can use her again, and just because I had so many spells, I, you know, just use one of them. Um, so, in total, got 700,000, 2700 Dark Elixir, awesome. Okay, nice, another good base. Uh, pretty similar to the previous base that we attacked. This base is everywhere, so if you know how to attack this base with this method, then you're going to be making a lot of resource quickly. So we're going to send out Queen, Healers, and uh, let's see which direction she takes. There are two Expos upgrading the core, so it's going to make it very easy because look at that core, it's very weak. Uh, because of the lack of point defenses inside the core, all the point defenses, most of the point defenses, the Archer Towers, Cannons, are all, all on the outside here. So as you can see, my queen's taking out that cannon. She's being targeted by two point defenses, both of those archer towers. But once she removes an archer tower, she's gonna be able to recover back quickly. Okay, so she's now gonna be able to recover back. And uh, also, that core is surrounded by air defenses and mortars. And what this means is that that core is weak to tanks, troops with high HP like uh, giants or barbarian king. But in this case, uh, the queen, because she's being supported by healers. We're gonna use that poison spell. That poison spell is gonna weaken those wizards. So yeah, my queen was able to very easily uh, ch take their hits and uh, remove them. So here she's gonna go for that mortar and then uh, the air defense, great. Uh, one, of, one of our healers is getting target, but hopefully our queen walks away from the range of that archer tower. Come on, come on. No. Okay, we lost one healer there. Uh, we could have used a uh, hog rider, but I'm being a bit stingy here. Don't want to waste any hog riders yet. Uh, but we still have three healers, which is going to be enough. We just need to use one rage spell possibly inside the core. Uh, let's now break, make that entry point here. Open up that first layer. Two pair, a pair of wall breakers. All right, and let's break inside here, here. Two wall breakers, another two wall breakers. And we're just gonna use that rage spell right here. Couple the rage spell with our wall breakers, healers, archer queen, barbarians, archers, everything. Send in the rest of our archers here. And there we go. Look at those troops. They're gonna completely wreck this core. Okay, we still have our hog riders now. Let's see. Um.
Hopefully she makes her way inside the core because I want her I want her to target the storages. Yeah, now she's gonna know what she's doing. What's what she doing? <laughs> she decided to go for the core, but then she uh, made a turn back. So it looks like she's gonna go after the elixir storage next. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Hopefully she doesn't go for the wall though. Hoping she doesn't go for the wall. So I'm just gonna send out some hog riders here. You know, just send them out and uh, remove these structures though, so they don't, they don't pull her. No giant bomb there. Another giant bomb. So it looks like we're gonna lose our hog riders, but whatever. We don't need them. I'm not gonna even heal them because uh, time's running out, and we haven't even used our queen's ability yet. So we're just gonna use our ability here because time's running low, and uh, we want some storages. So. 20 seconds, come on, target that golden elixir storage. 14 seconds, no. Looks like we're probably just gonna be, uh, just have enough time to get one storage. Uh, but that's fine, we still got a lot of resource. Five, four, three, two, one, and game. So uh, we've got a lot of resource, so lots of elixir, 350,000, 186,000 gold, so pretty good. Okay, nice. Around 600,000 in total. So we're going to attack. And we're going to attack from the top because that king's at the bottom. So we're just going to send out our queen here. And if you look at the point defenses, they're pretty weak. So not worry about that. Uh, and all the point defense, defenses, the cannons, archer towers are all on the outside. I'm guessing the Teslas are right on uh, around that town hall area. And possibly around here next to the sweepers as well. So here we're just going to have our queen traveling, have her walk around, and uh, don't have to worry about any threats. That air defense is almost in range. If it is, I'm going to send down my hog riders. Yeah, it is, but hopefully our queen can make her way. That air sweeper actually helped us out here. Uh, it pulled our healers away from the range of that air defense. So that's great. We don't have to send out our hog riders. And uh, we can have our queen continue to walk around. Okay, there we go. And now we're going to send out our barbarians and archers here. Let's send them out here. And open up here. And open up that one. Send in the rest of our archers here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to use that raid spell with those wall breakers along with the archer queen. And then couple it with the healers, that same raid spell. And we're also going to send out more wall breakers, open up that core area with that raid spell. So watch here, they're going to open here and then they should come here. Almost opened it, that's fine. Our queen's now around that core area and then she's going to make her way, let's see. Either, di either direction she makes, she's going to be able to get storages, so it's all good. Okay, Tesla's right there. But they're pretty far away, so no concern. And also Tesla's have poor range, only 7 tal attack range. Giant bomb, not a problem, we'll recover that. And uh, let's see, she's gonna remove the mortar and then the elixir collector and then she's gonna make her way towards this direction. Right after she removes that cannon. Okay, another giant bomb, not a problem. Now she's getting targeted. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to send out our hog riders. Didn't wanna use them, but looks like we have to because of uh, the archer tower targeting along with the air sweeper and the tesla over here so we're gonna need to use those hog riders and while the archer queen was distracting those defenses our hog riders were e able to easily remove uh the defenses out of the way clearing the defenses and now it's just gonna be very easy for a queen to get the rest of the resources inside those storages so here she's gonna break open here and then she's gonna get the elixir storage that tesla is gonna be unable to target our queen uh, with it with its seven tile range nope it's not actually uh, but that's fine only one point defense targeting her so we're just gonna get the elixir storage and we're just gonna head out here there we go lots of resource 384,000 elixir 200,000 gold okay that will be it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed that if you did be sure to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you guys again soon in the next episode later